Hello everyone. I'm here to do a quick review and also a what's in my bag on my new coach, Brian Crossbody. Um, this color is uh, metallic cherry. And on the website, it shows up and it looks brown. But when you get it, it's definitely a metallic cherry. It's got this beautiful on the side. It's got like this imitation. Um, I would say definitely say it's imitation because it's very stiff. It's not um, like a kind of a, a leather print, like a snake, like a snake print. And then it's on the strap too. It's got the long snake print and it's a metallic cherry. It comes with a really cute um, key, like a key um, tag, and that's really cute. That's also a metallic cherry. I got this from Bath and Body Works, and that goes on there very nicely, and it's for your hand sanitizer. It's got no feet on the bottom, but it's also got that snake skin on the bottom, and it's got a beautiful coach plate, and on the back, it's got one pocket on the back. And it's got a very unique pop-up opening. Um, all you do is press this and it, you know, pops right open. Close it and it snaps right shut. So you pop it back open. Like I said, it's very stiff. I've been using it for a week. So this definitely doesn't stay back yet. And it's kind of annoying when you're at the grocery store and you gotta pull your wallet out. Um, it's so stiff that it's hard to get my wallet back in. It's got a pocket, a zipper pocket in the back right there. But unfortunately, if you put anything in that zipper pocket, you can kiss this pocket goodbye because it kind of bulges out. So then you pretty much can't use anything in that pocket, but probably your keys and your mask. I have an iPhone 13 plus and it does not fit in here well at all. It's very, very stiff. I mean, you can put it standing up but then you take the risk of bumping something and it flipping, you know, falling out because it doesn't stay in there very well. Um, like I said, it's very stiff, so this doesn't stay open. And it's got the strap that goes through here. I don't really like that idea. Um, I hate to sound so negative on this bag, but I've been using it for a week and it's really, really hard to, um, to maneuver this type of strap that is constantly going around and around and around. It's just kind of annoying. So you, you have to put it on your, on your crossbody, but if you want to use it as a shoulder bag or just carry it, not as a crossbody, it's kind of hard because this is just going all over the place. Um, I've got my Dooney and Burke Kiss Lock bag purse in there. That's able to fit in there. Um, and then I've got my Coach wallet. It's a long one and that fits in there fine but that's pretty much it that can go in there. There's a first pocket right here that's not as deep. I have my reading glasses in there, my checkbook and a pen, and that's pretty much it. So, and when you're in the grocery store and you get your wallet out, you have anything in here, it's so stiff right now, so it's really, really hard to put that wallet in there. So then I end up walking out of the store like this. I mean, it's just like, and then I have to wait and go to my car and stuck everything back in there nicely and then close it because this thing is so hard to close, especially if you have a lot of things in there. So I snap it and close, but it does stay closed very nicely. Once it's closed, it's not like constantly popping. Well, now it is, but I mean, it really, I mean, I have it closed now and I mean, you have to really, really pull on it. So that's that review on that one. Um, other than that, I mean, besides the sniff, stiffness and, um, the strap that goes around like that, um, uh, that's about the only negative I would say that I dislike about the bag. Other than that, I love the coach. I love that part. Um, I love the side, how it has that and how it goes on the bottom. Very nice. But um, other than that, I'm hoping that once I use it more, that it will kind of, you know, get a little bit softer and not stay so hard. Um, but right now, um, I'm not really liking it, but I really don't want to send it back because I did get a, an amazing deal on it. Um, I think I spent $100 and it was regular, almost $400. And I would have never paid $400 for this purse. Maybe somebody else would, but not me. 
and I'm glad that I didn't pay $400 for this purse because I'm not really liking it. Um, but, you know, give me another week and ask me on the comments. And also, don't forget to give my video a like. And if you guys have any questions, let me know. But this is the Brian and Coach Crossbody purse. You guys all have an amazing day and talk to you guys soon. Bye.